This is the Electronics Lab, and you're watching 60 Second Circuits. In this video, I'm going to give you the history of Ohm's Law in 60 seconds or less, probably more. So let's put 60 seconds on the clock, jump into this river of info, and try not to drown. Ohm's Law states that the current through a conductor is directly proportional to the voltage across the conductor. This constant of proportionality is called the resistance. Ohm's Law can be written as I equals V over R, R equals V over I. The law is named after Georg Simon Ohm, a German physicist from the 19th century. He did some of the earliest experiments with electricity, including the ones that led to Ohm's Law. Ohm's Law is one of the earliest quantitative descriptions of the physics of electricity, and Ohm discovered it by performing experiments as we would when doing science today. However, the scientific philosophy of the time was that the order of nature could be determined from reasoning alone, so Ohm's work was called a web of naked fancies, and Ohm himself was deemed unworthy to teach science by the German Minister of Education. Nevertheless, the truth won out, and Ohm's Law is a foundation of electrical circuit theory today. The experiments Ohm performed involved using a thermocouple to provide a relatively stable voltage source to test wires of varying length, diameter, and material to complete a circuit. He used a galvanometer to measure the current through various wires. He determined the law of proportionality between the voltage and the current as x equals a over b plus l, where x is the galvanometer reading, l is the length of the test conductor, a depends on the thermocouple temperature, which corresponds to voltage, and b was a constant based on the internal resistance of the thermocouple and the type of material used. In more modern circuit diagram form, the circuit looks like this. And in modern notation, the equation looks like this. I equals E over little r plus big R, where I is the current, E is the EMF or the thermocouple, little r is the internal resistance of the thermocouple, and big R is the resistance of the test wire. In its most general form, Ohm's law looks like this. I equals V over R. Current equals voltage divided by resistance. And that gives you the 60 second, 90 second, background on the origins of Ohm's law. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.